In June of 2017, I was invited to join Captain Stephen Flanders, his brother Nicholas Flanders, and Bill Berkmeyer to sail for six days through the islands of Penobscot Bay and reach Northeast Harbor in Acadia National Park, then return under the Deer Island Bridge back to our starting point of Bucks Harbor. We would spend each night in our boat named Panache, which had enough space to sleep four comfortably, plus a kitchen and a bathroom or head, as well as a fold-away dining table. Each of us had brought a home-cooked meal to cover four nights and the other two meals we prepared on board. Our first night was spent in Pulpit Harbor on North Haven. It was serene and the lupins were in full bloom. The next day, we motored through Fox Island Thoroughfare into East Penobscot Bay, where we hoisted the sails in the open waters to reach our destination of Duck Harbor on Isle of Ho. We explored the area and caught our second sunset. The next day, we motored through the Isle of Ho Thoroughfare on our way to Tiny Harbor Island, where we set anchor and caught our third sunset and explored the island the next morning before heading off via the pretty town of Stonington on the southern tip of Deer Isle before reaching Northeast Harbor on Mount Desert Island where Acadia National Park is located. In Northeast Harbor, we explored the town and Astaque Gardens and went up to Bar Harbor for lunch. Then climbed the Beehive Trail high above Sand Beach. Next, we were off to spend the night in Burnt Coat Harbor on Swan Island and visit the lighthouse there and the quarry swimming hole across the harbor. Daddy, loading lumber on the deck, my bonny heel and daddy. When away we go, bonny daddy, heel and daddy. When away we go, my bonny heel and daddy. That's the refrain. Were you ever in Baltimore, bonny daddy, heel and daddy? Dancing on that sanded floor, my bonny heel and daddy. Way and away we go, bonny laddy, heel and laddy. Way and away we, we go, my bonny laddy and laddy. Were you ever in Dundee, bonny laddy, heel and laddy? There's some pretty ships you'll see, a bonny heel and laddy. Well, and away we go, bonny laddy, heel and laddy. Well, and away we go, a bonny heel and laddy. Were you? There were lots of signs that hard times had fallen on the lobster man. Down the dog. Well, okay. I didn't get back to work and he's going to fire me. So. Yep. We'll, we'll pay <laughs> <Okay>. the union <laughs> scale. Up over your head now, please. Okay. I'll do it on that. <laughs> I have to put my drink down. <laughs> oh, don't can't do that. <laughs> New $100 trap going down to the dock. It rained that night and the halyard clanged against the mast. Mm. 
going out on deck? Huh? Really? What for? I don't. I don't think it's worth getting soft and wet for. I think they're fixing up the swimming area. Maybe they don't want people diving off those cliffs. <laughs> Looks like a million miles away. <laughs> it's never. You never have the right lens line at the right time. Seaweed. <laughs> On our way back to Bucks Harbor, we made a stop at Brooklyn Boatyard, established in 1960, to build custom boats. Big ones. Seventy foot long boat. Then we continued over the top of Deer Isle under the huge bridge that connects it to the mainland and back to our dock. Coming into Bucks Harbor after uh, six days or seven days at sea. And uh, I think that's the which is heart shaped. Back in port, we're all tied up at our berth. Quiet, foggy morning. Take it for a shop. Yeah. <laughs> if you want me to just separate that out of the cruising kitty and you can buy one and a half beers on the way home, just <laughs> share them, right? We actually have a beer. On the way home, we stopped at Camden for lunch. Back in White River Junction, it was pouring. Sure glad we didn't have any weather like that out on the water. Head, Tom, Lily, oh boy, you're going to die. That's all there is that I know of that one. <laughs>